Hi guys, uh, welcome to another episode of the Go and Appetit and uh, today we are focusing on uh, breakfast. Well folks, today we are in the coastal village of Majorta beautiful, quaint and quiet. So on today's episode, we're actually going to be trying out this uh, very local uh, restaurant called the Azra restaurant and it serves a variety of uh, delectable and tasty Goan snacks for breakfast as well as the Goan bhajis and of course the highlight of what we're here for today, the sweet Goan bun. Goa, we do things a little differently because, um, as you can see, it's uh, we've got a, three sets of uh, bhajis and of course the Goan pao, very very famous. We did an episode last time focusing just on how this is made. As I said before, we're here to try out the local Goan buns, the sweet bun. It's, it's slightly different from the Goan pao that we make. And we'll talk about that. We're going to get to this. I'm saving it for the last because they say save the best for the last, right? So, definitely waiting for the last for this. Until then, I'm going to enjoy my mushroom shakti. And uh, well, I hope you guys can come out here and try it out as well. It's made with a shakti masala. And if you've been to Goa before, you'll definitely know what a shakti masala is. Usually it's with the chicken, but uh, this is a little bit of a variation on that with the mushrooms uh, being the sauce um, and it looks absolutely delicious. Let me try it out with the famous Goan Pao. Oh wow. So delicious, really, really, really nice, really good. Uh, this isn't spicy at all, this is really tasty, and um, you can actually feel the flavors of the masala coming through. It goes really well with bang. So good. Yeah. So, what we've all been waiting for is finally here. <laughs> come all the way to the south in Majorta just to try out the sweet corn buns so uh, let's uh, break into it it's a little hot of course uh, and that's the perfect way to eat the bun nice hot with some chai of course that I have out here so let's break into this and let's see how good it is mm. oh, nice lovely so this actually looks really really nice it's it's, it's a little brown on the outside, but as you can see on the inside, nice and fluffy, nice and soft. And let's uh, dig into it. It goes well with tea, so. It's so nice. Uh, the reason why I suggest you have it with tea is because it might be dry otherwise. Uh, but if you like to have bread with tea, uh, a sweet bun with tea, absolutely perfect combo in the morning uh, for a good breakfast. Mm. 